This beaver job began with a call from an apartment complex in need of professionals to have a colony of beavers removed due to the damages, dangers, flooding, and liabilities these incredible animals were causing. They called the right people. All right, we're starting a job for uh, do a lab capture for beaver. Uh, we're in a suburb of Chicago, and the beavers have been doing considerable damage. Uh, they've been cutting down all these gigantic trees. And what's happening is uh, an apartment complex behind us, and all the kids are using this as their playground and climbing up and down the trees. Uh, there's one tree behind me, the one I'm leaning on. The kids actually uh, brought two full-size couches all the way up the tree, so the uh, apartment complex is worried about the kids getting hurt. And they had the city out here trying to trap them, and they were kill trapping them. And uh, the beaver were outsmarting the city. They just weren't trained professionals, and that's why they hired us. So we're doing live capture to get these beavers safely trapped and relocated and uh, save anybody from getting hurt. And as you can see, they've been chewing down trees that are four feet in diameter. And they've also been uh, damming the creek up, which is flooding out the complex, and it's also flooding out the roads. And all the way up the creek, there's houses that have been getting their, their backyards flooded. So beaver have to go and get moved out to the country where they belong and get them out of the city setting. Uh, there's hundreds of kids out here and we had a great big mob of kids every time we've been out here and it's time for the beavers to move to a better place. <laughs> With equipment in hand we set to work. Brad put on his waders and got right in there inspecting the entire area that the beavers were inhabiting. He purposefully pulled apart portions of the dams to help relieve some of the flooding upstream and to drain down the creek in order to aid in the capture of the beavers. Only hours later, Brad had already caught the first beaver. With a harmless lasso around its waist, keeping it from going anywhere, Brad wrestles to secure the beaver and get it into a cage for transportation. Once the beaver is in the trap, we take him to the release site, a private property we selected that is specifically suited to a beaver's needs without the issue of human conflict. We just got out here to the uh, release site. We're going to take the beaver we trapped earlier today and let him go in the creek behind me. So let me get the door opened up and get this guy out of here. It's a little breezy today. There you go. The next beaver we trap happens on a Saturday, and we are greeted by a very excited crowd. Oh, hell no. Did he get out the trap? 
No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't <laughs> so strong. Oh my god. You see that cable? Here he comes. Give me that other cable. Which one? That's that big cable. I need to put one more on him. Let's show. Throw it to me. I will. Hold on a second. Sure, that's show. Oh, stupid. Okay, ready? Go. Oh, you're careful, Dave. You're careful. What are you doing? He's punching it. He's releasing it. He got it. He's heavy. Oh my god. That's it. Hey! <laughs> He's big. He is big. He's probably 65, 70 pounds. Maybe, maybe Mom, this is a little bit of a shout out to You guys give him a hand. Look at this tail. Yeah. Clap your hands for him. Oh, hey, you guys. This stinks. How about yeah, the bear stinky? What up? Oh, why his tail? Dude, look at his claws. I can't let him go. He's too nice. You can see that. What do you think? Pretty cool, huh? Awesome. Excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> you want to see it? Do we have to go in there? Do we have to go in there? Oh, man. Let me take it. This is awesome. Tired him out. Michaela is in the cage. Oh wow. I'm scared. I was gonna bite you in the cage. Big guy. Look at his feet. Okay, so what do you guys want to say to the viewers on YouTube? The this is the biggest. They look at me now. I caught this. This, over. this was the hardest thing you've ever catch. Give me the hood. Give me the beaver ever. Say the biggest beaver in the hood. It's the biggest beaver in the hood. He caught it. He caught it. He caught it. 245. I don't know. Really? 245. We don't know who it's supposed to be. I caught this myself. Okay. Now everybody, just say goodbye. Goodbye.